Service costing is crucial for business that want to understand their profitability. Service costing is an extensive use to healthcare industry to determine the cost of providing a medical service to the patient. The product costing which is nothing but the physical product, how much the company are producing, the service provider, they are offering a different service. Hello everyone, a warm welcome to one and all. I am Natesh, lecturer in commerce, Vidyashram First Grade College, Mysore, the temple of excellence. We are in the Uni 2 session 4, uh, uh, the fourth semester BCom costing methods and technique. The chapter name is uh, process and service costing and the last three session which is completely related to process costing. This session is uh, related to service costing and today my agenda is so introductions to the service costing and the application of service costing service costing versus product costing and uh, cost unit for different service sector because uh, when the physical product what cost methods we adapted but service is something different right so moving forward so uh, here the introductions to service costing the definition of service costing because service is not able to see but the costing you need to each and every service provider they want to maintain one standard one method one techniques okay so here the definition of service costing service costing is a process uh, of identifying and allocating cost to various activity involved providing a survey whenever the service provider either telecom either which is related to hospitality okay so there are different types of service we are identified there are different different process will be going on so you need to calculate the cost when you are offering a service to this those who are really required so importance of service costing service costing is crucial for business that want to understand their profitability because they want to get to know what exactly they are getting a profit uh, what and all the costs are incurred uh, at the time of provide, uh, providing or preparation or process uh, so different different costs are involved and make informed decision about the pricing and resource allocation because even the service how the physical product are depending on the different resource even service also provide depending on the number of resource so obviously we need to calculate the service cost it's very important before they are offering to the end service required people so the types of cost in service costing there are three main type of costs that are relevant to service costing one is direct cost which is related to directly which is involved for the service of preparing okay and indirect cost which is the overheads we can call it as a overheads here and other overheads cost so here there are different types of cost will be incurred obviously we need to identify the direct cost indirect cost and overhead cost at the time of preparing or offering a service to the needy people direct cost or expense that can be directly traced to the specific survey such as labor cost or materials at the time of preparation of course we need to depend on the material we need to depend on the labor cost which is directly involved for a service and the method of service costing there are several methods that can be used for service costing including activity based costing which is nothing but there are different types of activity at the time of offering a service to the service needy people so activity based costing and the process costing moving forward here the service application of service costing where exactly service costing is preparing either we can call it as an operating costing because the operation which is carried uh, under service sector so the service costing has a numerous application across various industry. Here are some examples are healthcare or hospital, okay, because of which is they are providing a survey. So uh, which is uh, they want to identify the unit uh, which is related to healthcare or hospitality. So service costing is an extensive use to healthcare industry 
to determine the cost of providing a medical service to the patient. So here identify the services offered to the patient because we are talking related to health care means hospitality. Now consultancy service, there are different types of consultancy we identified. So they are preparing operating costing. So service costing used to consultanting firm to determine the true cost delivering their service to their client. Because at the time of preparing a, a cost sheet, uh, of course, uh, they want to adapt the costing technique and method, which is a full disclosing information they want to expect here. So now telecommunication, that is also one kind of service industry or service sector. A uh, service costing is an extensive use in the telecommunication industry to determine the cost of providing various services like data, voice, uh, messaging. Okay, so there are different uh, uh, product are offering with the help of telecommunication. They want to calculate so each and every city uh, because of uh, metropolitan city, the service package, what they are offering, the, which is not same in the other city. So they want to calculate. Now the transportation. Because of transportation, we will get to know uh, there are two transportation. One is passenger carry and goods carry. Okay, so of course we need to calculate the what and all which is involved for the transportation. Service costing is used to transportation industry to determine the cost providing different service like uh, hair, uh, rail, uh, road transportation. Okay, water transportation, whatever it may be, you need to calculate. You can't blindly fix a fare. So, uh, based on the calculations only, we can decide what exactly the fare, what and all in, is involved per kilometers, how much we can decide here. And financial service, we know that there are financial banking service or industry or insurance company. Okay, service costing is used to financial service industry to determine the cost providing various services like uh, wealth management, investment banking, they want to pre the, set the premium or they want to go for analyzing the what exactly the product price will be or service price will be. Moving for the service costing versus product costing. So the product costing which is nothing but the physical product, how much the company are producing, the service provider, they are offering a different service. Okay. So what and all the aspects we can identify here. First one is the definitions for the service costing. So a method used to determine the cost of providing a survey before offering a service, we need to know Okay, as a service provider, they want to get more clarity about the or how much they want to incur the uh, expenditure. And the product costing, the method used to determine the cost of producing a product. So here also, it is equally involved for direct costing, indirect costing, other overheads. So they want to calculate here. And the focus. Under service costing, the cost of input to use to provide this survey. So before, uh, before offering a service, what and all the cost is incurred, we need to calculate. So based on the different application of service, the cost here under product costing, the cost of unit used to produce the product. So what cost uh, incurred, raw material cost, labor cost, machine cost, what and all is incurred incurred that is the focus here and the nature of cost obviously predominant variable cost uh, such labor and material so each and every time the whenever they are offering a service the cost is keep on varied here based on the availability and the predominant fixed cost here fixed cost such as machinery and equipment space rent factory rent so which is now costing system under service costing we are preparing a job costing or process costing is a very suitability here so why because each and every service is unique right that's what so under product costing job costing also possible process costing as well as activity based costing inventory 
under inventory there is no inventory in the service or intangible the service is always intangible so we can't store right so that's what and in case of a physical product uh, of course the finished goods inventory work in progress semi progress semi work in progress and inventory are very very important okay so next timings here under service costing cost are incurred at the same time as the service is used because whenever you are preparing whenever you are offering a service the cost what exactly you bear so which is each time will vary but in case of physical product the cost is incurred during the production process only production process only but example here accounting consulting health care telecommunication so we have what and all we studied in the previous slide so that is an example but in case of physical product like a car furniture cloth fmcg product fmcd product so this is a best example and here each service uh, costing of course the cost unit for the different service sector we need to get more clarity so here the service sector like health care the cost unit is nothing but the per patient or per procedure okay the treatment but the exp uh, the cost is calculated based on the treatment received by the patient okay and next hospitality per guest uh, or per room night uh, so which is an hospitality the cost is calculated based on the guest stay occupations okay because and the transportation in case of transportation no doubt which is calculated on the basis on per mile or per trip or per kilometers the cost is calculated based on the distance traveled i just now i told there are two one is passenger wise as well as uh, the goods wise in case of service like uh, education per student per course uh, which is the best unit cost unit the cost is calculated based on the number of student enrolled or course offered that is very important how they are charging so and in case of consulting per hour per project okay per hour what how much you are spending how much you are getting an idea so which is completely in case uh, the cost is calculated based on the time or scope of the project because consultant the most of the time they are try to undertake the project right that's what under legal service per hour or per case so whenever you are try to consult with the legal advisor like legal advisor advocate uh, they are charging based on the uh, they are charging using a terminology called the fees how they are charging per hour or per case the cost is calculated based on the time spent on the case and the nature of the case so okay which is because different types of case will be dealing with the different advocates okay keep on watch for next section thank you